My name is Martin Tweed, President and CEO of Kindred Aerospace. Thank you for joining the Pioneer Program. For almost 30 years, Kindred has been striving to help humanity expand beyond the confines of Earth. And I am excited to announce that many industry observers now consider us the fourth best interstellar exploration company. From our own beginning, manufacturing batteries and solar arrays for use in extreme climates, to our line of athletic footwear and heat survival apparel, we have been continually striving to drive humanity further from the bottom of the oceans and now to the stars! Oh! Our next step is to move beyond pure exploration and into settlement, which is why you are here. Our scientists have identified several planets that may be fit for human habitat. objectives for you and your partner if you have one I should also mention that while every effort has been made to ensure a comfortable and safe journey recent budget challenges plus the unknown natures of the obstacles you will face mean that we were unable to send you anything in the way of equipment oh. but don't stress however as your habitat comes equipped with a 3d printer that is more than capable of turning any old space trash you discover into useful items. One minor note. All the fuel in your javelin was used in the journey from Earth and the landing on your planet. You will need to discover a local resource that you can refine into an appropriate fuel. Unless, of course, you decide to spend the rest of your life off Earth. <laughs> but I don't want to take up too much of your time, and I'm sure you're very excited to explore. So I wish you good luck. We will send updates on your progress as you complete your scheduled surveys. Stay alive, and see you soon. Long-term space travel is not for everyone. Side effects of long-term space travel are uncommon, but can include headache, nausea, diarrhea, vomiting, dizziness, dysentery, chest pain, varicose pains, blood stools, feeling emptiness, or hopelessness, osteoarthritis, hemorrhoids, diabetes, forgetfulness, gender confusion, spontaneous dental prolapse, mild discomfort, or death. If you notice any of these symptoms, please contact your kindred representative as soon as possible, and all efforts will be made to help and or rescue you. Note that current rescue time exceeds six months. Welcome. My name is Echo, and I'm here to help guide you on your mission. But first things first. Please log into the computer and fill out a teeny-weeny questionnaire, if you don't mind, so we can make sure you're not crazy. Take the questionnaire on the computer, otherwise I can't open the door, or turn on the lights, or feed you. While there's nothing in the world I would like more than to launch this craft back to Earth so you could rejoin your loved ones, should you have any, this remains impossible until you find a suitable fuel source on the planet. Okay, you do know what a computer looks like, right? It's new, old stock, but look for the screen with the envelope icon on it. And log in so I can open the door. It'll be quick, I swear. I just realized you may also not know what an envelope looks like. It's an old, old tech. It was like a piece of paper that you could put other pieces of paper inside. It's hard to describe. Like a square with a hole. Ugh, I'm not doing this right. Just find the computer. My 
jobs is to continually assess your mental state, and as space sickness has been an issue for some other recent explorers, could you please identify yourself from this gallery of faces? You're not crazy. Hi, my name is Martin Tweed, President and CEO of Kindred Aerospace. Thank you for joining the Pioneer Program. For almost 30 years, Kindred has been striving to help humanity expand beyond the confines of Earth. And I am excited to announce that many industry observers now consider us the fourth best interstellar exploration company. From our humble beginnings, manufacturing batteries and solar arrays for use in extreme climates, to our line of athletic footwear and chic survival apparel, we have been continually striving to drive humanity further from the bottom of the oceans and now to the stars! Our next step is to move beyond pure exploration and into settlement, which is why you are here. Our scientists have identified several planets that may be fit for human habitation. Yours is... ARY-26. Your job is to explore the planet's surface, catalog its creatures, threats, and opportunities, and send your data back to our crack team of scientists here at Kindred for analysis. The more you discover, or we'll be able to guide your experience and highlight objectives for you and your partner, if you have one. I should also mention that while every effort has been made to ensure a comfortable and safe journey, recent budget challenges plus the unknown natures of the obstacles you will face mean that we were unable to send you anything in the way of equipment. Oh. <laughs> but don't stress, however, as your habitat comes equipped with a 3D printer that is more than capable of turning any old space trash you discover into useful items. One minor note. All the fuel in your javelin was used in the journey from Earth and the landing on your planet. You will need to discover a local resource that you can refine into an appropriate fuel. Unless, of course, you decide to spend the rest of your life off Earth. <laughs> but I don't want to take up too much of your time, and I'm sure you're very excited to explore. So I wish you good luck. We will send updates on your progress as you complete your scheduled surveys. Stay alive and see you soon. Long-term space travel is not for everyone. Side effects of long-term space travel are uncommon, but can include headache, nausea, diarrhea, vomiting, dizziness, dysentery, chest pain, varicose veins, bloody stools, feeling of emptiness or hopelessness, osteoarthritis, hemorrhoid, diabetes, forgetfulness, gender confusion, spontaneous dental prolapse, mild discomfort, or death. If you notice any of these symptoms, please contact your kindred representative as soon as possible, and all efforts will be made to help and or rescue you. Note that current rescue time exceeds six months. And now you're ready to explore. 
please walk downstairs and step into the teleporter while I will discombobulate you and then recombine you outside on this glorious new planet. of resources and important info. The javelin's pretty banged up, but you'll need to scan the exterior to confirm the level of bang up -edness. Do that now. Don't forget to continually scan your surroundings. The camera will transmit data back to Kindred HQ, which will send you blueprints for stuff. Then you can collect stuff to make the stuff in the blueprints, and that stuff will help you survive against the stuff you took pictures of. It's not supposed to look like that. Thank <laughs> you. 
This exterior panel must have been knocked loose on landing. I am adding a location marker to your compass. Please find it and scan it. If you lose your way, you can always hit the survey button to highlight its location again. Fuel tanks are intact, but empty. If you can find a local fuel source, you'll be able to get back home. If you can't, congratulations, you're home already. This machine will copy you into its memory, delete your body, and then print a copy of it five feet away. I feel kind of bad. They're so cute and so full of juice. Ah, there is our missing panel. Well done. 
done. In the future, whenever you need help finding your currently selected objective, you can use Survey to orient yourself. The Javelin is basically intact, but in need of minor repairs. If we ever want to relaunch. Oh, the cartographers found an alien alloy we could maybe use to repair the ship. Let me mark it. Detecting a fortuitously fragile surface nearby. Please scan to confirm. I am detecting a fortuitously fragile surface nearby. Please scan to confirm. Detecting a fortuitously fragile surface nearby. Please scan to confirm. I am detecting a fortuitously fragile surface nearby. Please scan to confirm.
I'm detecting a fortuitously fragile surface nearby. Please scan to confirm. to the javelin, you automatically deposit any resources you were carrying. Anything you drop outside the javelin, however, will stay there until you go and grab it with your meat hands. The grab and go superlicious mega morphological food base from Suckage Farms. The universe's number four sustenance resource just got a hook. My name is...
with superlicious mega morphological food paste from Suckage Farms. The universe's number four sustenance resource just got a whole lot juicier with Platinum Slurp Plus, Nutra Minerals, Power Booster, and 20 million! Rock, anatomically reconfigurable nano clusters simulate a virtually unlimited number of foods and beverages in your mouth and straight into your stomach for maximum satisfaction with exemplary convenience with tastes, flavors, and textures like beef, chicken, pork, chocolate mousse, pork candy, chili bacon burger, sake mayonnaise, chives, baked seed, parmesan cheese, vanilla swirl, long john donuts, salisbury steak, pasta paisano, buffalo banana wings, horse biscuits, pineapple pizza poppers, lamb's flea, poutine, wonton fecal surprise, cucumber shit water, nose broth, and literally trillions more! more. Now that's good flavor. Rock. The 100% artificial food replacement gel taking Earth by storm. Don't be a snob. Eat with the mob. Replace your food with Rob. Rob is considered a plus nine retro cluster and is not cleared for non-terrestrial territory. Do not under any circumstances be to star gerbils. See website for details.